Well, good day tubers. It's not often I load two videos in one day. Sorry about the light it's glaring on the poster there, but I don't have it on. Someone won't be able to see nothing. But, uh, I knew something was coming in the mail. My brother Sonora Tim said him and brother H were out somewhere come across something and brother H said that is Brooksy right there all over he's I gotta get that for him I gotta get that for him and uh, you know Tim had told me it was coming which uh, you know I only got to meet brother H once I've met brother Tim many times he's come over from Kentucky and uh oops, I was trying to get the box up, but look at the box <laughs> come in. Double boxed up and everything. I mean I was quite surprised, quite surprised. But uh I guess I could just show it to you instead of just keep talking. <laughs> but uh look at this thing. Get in the correct lighting here. And I left one arrow out, but it's a red fox quiver with two homemade arrows. Got bone arrows with it. And it's actually what I thought was super cool is this right here. Made by Curtis Bitsui. Navajo tribe. Got a little medicine man bag on it there. Has the medicine wheel with an abalone shell. Some other homemade beads, but patina it up. Some kind of blue to blackish feather, I'm not sure, but he did a nice job on them fletchings. Real nice job. All the way down. Uh, nice eagle feathers here that came with it. Actually, oh, it blew off the table here. Ah, had to, uh, reach down here and get it. Oh, this was stuffed in side of it, which I kind of knew this too. But uh, it says a prayer feather. The Native American believe the eagle feather carries dreams, thoughts, and prayers. It is also a healer when used with natural herbs. Carrying a feather with you is also a protector and good luck. And I thought that was really cool that that was in there. But, uh, man, Brother H, I can't say, but wow, dude, you that, that just blows me away. Uh, man, thank you so much. Uh, like I was getting to, you know, I only got to meet Brother H one time in person, and he's a hell, hell of a guy. I mean, just like Brother Tim. That's why they've been best friends their whole life. And uh, they've always done everything together. And then he, Tim, oh, he got sucked in by the rock and said, Howard, you got to come with me, brother. <laughs> and uh, Howard, he got bit by the rock right as well. As you've seen, he'll dig through anything. And that's a true rock hound. And uh, man, I mean, this made my whole week. <laughs> My water was frozen and everything. It's actually back on now. It just come back on. Thank gosh. But man, this is just awesome. I mean, it's really nicely made. Uh, I'd like to fiddle fart around with it. But we're just going to oops, let it hang like that. I'll mess with the arrow a little bit later. Get it stuck back. I had it like in the edge of that thing. But this up here is made tight and get the arrow out and uh when i got that out then i heard something rattling around in there and i was like what in the world i pull out this little thing and it had these two points in it but i show them to you one at a time a little archaic side notch here got some killer iron ore patina on it 
Looks like it had an impact break on it once and they reworked it over to a little blunt point. Uh, which most of them Indians, they was, uh, they was pretty, uh, what do you call it? What's the word I'm looking for? Uh, da, 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 da. You know what I mean. <laughs> but, uh, man, just killer. And then it had this in it, and this, wow, this blew me away. This little big red sandy perforator, which is actually this camera. Oops, sorry, is it going to do it justice? Because it's got all this blue and purple speckles in it and everything. And this is just awesome. Just killer. And, man, I can't. Can't say thank you enough, Howard. You're awesome, brother. That's just very, very cool of you. And that's the great thing about our community. There's always the giving, and it's not just when it's me, but I like watching it. I like it more when I see it happen with other people. But, man, I'll really, really treasure that. Thank you very much. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know what the camera flip's going to do, but that's just awesome, ain't it? I guess that's going to be its new hanging spot, too, but I'm going to have to fix that arrow. All right. We will get off here. Thank you, Brother H and Brother Tim. Hope you guys come for the show, which hopefully we'll be getting a flyer soon. Should be the last weekend of February. I'm going to double check that. Later.